Hi folks, back again, Basil Chronicles 157, and uh, I'm sure most of you have heard of the flight attendant who got ticked off, grabbed a beer, uh, I think said some curse words or something, and uh, pulled that gizmo that allows that uh, balloon thing to come out where you slide down, you know, the rescue gizmo. Uh, well, the latest thing is, is that he, uh, this is September 7th, He's evidently trying, I believe, as I understand, trying to negotiate some kind of deal. And of course, as part of that, uh, he will undergo a mental health evaluation. Have you ever noticed that any time any of us do anything, if we have the right lawyer, <laughs> we're going to be evaluated? Uh, I don't care what it is. We always want to evaluate people. Now, to some extent, if you have a seriously mental, mentally ill person, I can understand that uh, the judge may not want to incarcerate someone who, uh, whose mental illness, for lack of a better word, caused them to do something that under normal circumstances they wouldn't. You know, I think we can all have some kind of an appreciation for that. But why is it that everything that happens out there, just about, we want to evaluate someone? What does evaluation mean anyway? Have any of you guys ever been evaluated? I haven't, <laughs> not yet. <laughs> Both. Only time. <laughs> As my assistant said, only time. <laughs> but anyway, uh, and don't get me wrong, there, you know, there, there are people who men, who are mentally ill and they need treatment, and and it's good that there's some folks out there who are competent to treat them. You know, as I said, some folks. Anyway, it seems like the answer to everything is, oh, let's put them in a hospital. Let's do this. Let's do that. You know, regardless of what they have done. And this happens all the time. But I guess the question I'm posing here is, uh, why is it that this is what we always do, regardless of how silly or benign the situation was? I mean, this guy, okay, maybe he had a bad day. Maybe he was just over it. Maybe he's been doing this too long. I think he's been doing this 20 plus years. He's been a, a flight attendant or uh, a steward or, or whatever term you want to use. And yeah, maybe, Maybe he's been provoked many times by, you know, by the public. You know, I wouldn't want to do that job. And um, maybe this was just a natural uh, occurrence or, or consequence or whatever term you want to use of all the years he's had to put up with this baloney. But should we evaluate him just because he had a beer and launched himself out of the plane and said adios? <laughs> I really don't think so. I mean, come on. You know, we're evaluating everyone. Pretty soon there's not going to be anybody out there. No one will be left. We'll all be evaluated. <laughs> anyway, as Pat Condell would say, peace, ladies and gentlemen, peace, and, and don't let anybody evaluate you. <laughs>